I wrote this program called Tip Calculator to calculate the amount of tip to leave on a meal. Now, when I run the thing, nothing happens. Hmm. So today we're going to talk about how to find the errors and fix them in your program. This is called debugging. Programmers refer to errors as bugs. And there's actually a historical reason for that, but let's not get into that. So let me just go over what this program is supposed to do. So here I have my script right here. I've declared a bunch of variables, cost of meal, tip percent, tip amount, and total. And actually, uh, this is a good opportunity to talk about how I write the name of these variables. Um, typically, this is style in programming, but oftentimes people will write uh, a bunch of words beginning with the first letter lowercase, and then each, uh, each other word has starts with an uppercase letter. This is referred to as camel case sometimes, right? So C is a lowercase, but O is uppercase, M is uppercase. This is a very common style, and you should probably get used to this style of writing variables. And I also make my variable names meaningful. You want to get into that habit too. Slash slash of course means comment. So I'm just saying what these things are. Hey, this is the cost of a meal. This is the percent tip. This is the amount of tip, the total cost of the meal. All right. So I'm asking the user to enter two things. Please enter the total cost of your meal, not including tip. And then I say, what percent tip would you like to leave? And the default is 15%, but you could change that of course. And then I'm calculating the tip amount is cost of the meal times 0 0.01 times tip percent, because of course, if they're giving me a tip in terms of percent, you multiply it by 0 0.01 to make it a decimal. Yeah, and then I'm adding that tip amount to the, to the cost of the meal, and that gives me my total. And notice at the end here, I'm printing this out using an alert statement, alert pop-up box. Uh, and, ooh, yeah, I'm rounding everything to two decimal places, right? Cost of meal dot two fixed, yeah, remember how that works? Um, tip percent, um, tip amount dot two fixed, and total dot two fixed. So I'm rounding everything to two decimal places. Again, when I run it, it doesn't work. Well, the good news is this little editor finds your errors for you. It's so awesome. Now, I haven't talked about this console panel yet, but I'm going to pull this up. And when I ran it, <clears throat> I could do it again. When I ran it, it tells me I have a syntax error. Something's wrong with my program invalid or unexpected token at, oh, this is the best part, line 14, character 91. Oh my goodness. This is line 14 right here, character 41. I mean, I could actually count these all the way across here and it's somewhere around right here. Oh, I could see what I'm missing already. I have a first set of quotes and then I'm missing a quote here, hmm, quote, quote. So let me put that in and I'll rerun the thing. Oops, I think I typed two quotes. I'm gonna rerun it. And, oh my God, another error. This time, line 20. So I'm gonna go down to line 20. And, <clears throat> ah, that's this line right here. Let me just make sure I have quotes and pluses, everything, let's see, quote, end quote, plus. Yeah, quote, end quote. And let's see. I think I have everything in quotes and do I have everything? Oh, I see what I'm missing. I'm missing a plus. So you have to really look very carefully. I'm missing a plus between those things. I'm gonna run it one more time. Oh, I got my total. So my meal was $30, 15%. Oh, it still doesn't work. Now it tells me, again, I'm looking at the console. It tells me um, type error, cost of meal is not a function, line 17. Line 17. Oh yes, that's this line right here. I'm missing, right? You can't just stick parentheses next to each other. I'm missing the multiplication. Yeah, all right, let's see if that works. Oh my goodness. And enter the cost of the meal, $30, 15%. And oh my goodness, another error. What is wrong now? Um, let's see, line 20. Again, I'm missing something else. And I could calculate, I mean, I could uh, count this, tip amount dot to fix. Now, hopefully this is it. I'll run it, my $30 meal, 15%. And there we go. It calculated your meal, $30, a 15% tip is $4.50. 50 the total cost with the tip is $34.50. And that works. 
Okay, so I just wanted to go through an example of a program that had some bugs in it, some errors in it, how to go about fixing it. I look at this console all the time. It is so awesome. And this also gives you an idea of how you might design your program. All right, well, thanks so much for watching and get started on your project.